That mystery along the California coastline, the sea pups washing ashore so hungry and so weak. Tonight there is a giant effort underway to nurse them back to life. ABC's Clayton Sandell was there as one of the calls came in late today. Hello, Marine Rescue. In 27 years, saving sea creatures big and small, Peter Wallerstein is seeing something he's never seen before. They do look so cute, but they do have a bite 10 times greater than a pit bull. Wallerstein normally rescues about 200 sea lion pups in an entire year, but now the animals are beaching themselves in unprecedented numbers. Tell me about this year. This year, it's been an alarmingly high number of rescues. I've done 200 rescues since January 1st. The animals are are showing up all over Southern California beaches, skinny and starving. Scientists say they don't know exactly why. They do know that for some reason, there simply isn't enough food for the sea lions to eat. Commercial bait fishermen friends of mine said there's no bait in the water, no anchovies, no sardines, no mackerel, um, the kind of food that these animals eat. Just seconds after we finish our interview, another call. Tower 4 Santa Monica, baby seal, very young. Uh, eyes are barely open. Peter carefully moves in. <laughs> this is already Peter's fifth rescue of the day. The bodies will keep each other warm. They're both severely hypothermic. Rescue shelters are filling up with tired, huddled masses of sea lion pups. So far this year, more than 500. So their chances are what? Chances are great right now. Until experts figure out what's going on with the sea lions, rescuers like Wallerstein will be on the beach trying to save them. Clayton Sandell, ABC News, Santa Monica, California. Loved hearing that there. The ones that have been saved, they're doing great.